So there is no logic behind it at all. The only logic is that they will take the money and they will run, uh, run away. <laughs> Hi guys, I am right now in Dubai South and I came to make a quick inspection of the units in Urbana. It's a town homes, so behind me is an example. A three bedroom unit is down and a two bedroom is up. It's not a town house where you have one unit and two floors. No, we have one unit down and one unit up. And I will go right now to the three bedroom. And uh, while I'm going there, you will be able to see the unit. And uh, I want to tell you uh, something about one scam. Uh, that uh, I hope this information will help you to uh, avoid uh, some problems because honestly speaking I don't know how you can avoid uh, this kind of scams uh, rather than not uh, signing, signing up uh, for this. Uh, so uh, what I want to tell you is uh, related to the rentals and uh, you as an investor you have an option to uh, rent a property on the long term and on the short term. And uh, when you're renting a property on the short term, uh, you can uh, give it to the company uh, who will rent it and uh, you will share the, the profits. Uh, alternative option is, is when you give uh, your unit for rent to the company. So they are renting it from you and they are subleasing it. And uh, in this case, uh, it can be quite risky for you uh, because what can happen is that uh, the company will rent it from you f in 12 checks, so they will pay it to you on a monthly basis, okay? But uh, they can rent your unit uh, to somebody uh, like in one check. So they can receive money from the tenant for the entire year. year. Uh, this is a common practice in Dubai. And uh, unfortunately what can happen is that uh, such companies or when they have enough <laughs> payments, they can just disappear. And uh, what will happen is that the tenant paid for entire year, uh, but you as the landlord, at some point you stop receiving money uh, that you're supposed to receive monthly because the company, company ran away. So you as the landlord is not receiving the money, the tenant had paid uh, for the money, but now you have to evict uh, this tenant uh, because you're not uh, receiving your payments. And it's actually a quite difficult uh, process. And uh, what is bad about this, it's very uh, difficult uh, to avoid or to predict that you can be in the trouble because a company has, can have a good reputation, they can have a lot of units, but over a sudden they decided to do something bad. So the only way how you can avoid any issues with such structure is not to get involved in, uh, in such deals. And uh, if a deal looks like very good, it's another sign that uh, you should be uh, suspicious, uh, suspicious about it. There are even cases where, let's say, the market price for the unit is uh, 100,000. Uh, These companies will rent it from you for 110, 115 in 12 checks. Uh, but at the same time, they will le uh, uh, rent it to the tenant, sublease it for 90,000. So there is no logic behind it at all. The only logic is that they will take the money and they will run uh, run away. So this is how it works and this is the unit that <laughs> I was visiting today. This is Urbana, three bedroom unit. Uh, I was really impressed when I visited for the first time. Uh, I like the size, uh, it's, it's very spacious. Three bedroom units have as well a garden uh, over here and Imar is offering a very good uh, payment plan where you have three years post handover payment plan right now. Uh, please double check it. I'm not sure when you're watching this video, uh, but as of now, uh, there is a three years post handover payment plan and as well, uh, three years waiver of the service fees. So get in touch with me. I'll be happy to share with you the details. And uh, obviously we can meet here as well and I can show you the, the property itself. Thank you for watching and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye.